This image from an early cartoon was censored because the animals are kissing. Even legendary directors like Howard Hawks were not above the censors. Scarface, a groundbreaking film, was engaged in a violent battle with the censors for its own life. This was due to its sensational treatment of gangsters and the more than 30 deaths in the film, with more off screen. And yet sometimes even being under the censors, right under their noses that is, directors could get away with a lot. In The Maltese Falcon, the homosexual villain makes sexual gestures with a cane. This and other parts of the movie made it past the censors unnoticed. Why were there censors in the first place? The 1930s were a time of extreme conservatism coming on the heels of the Roaring Twenties. Many cited the lax morality of the 1920s as the cause for this, the Great Depression. Also, cinema, as a relatively new art form, had lots of experimentation, especially with the advent of synchronous sound films, or talkies. Experimentation was cause for controversy. So, of course, to remedy all this, Censorship became stricter, and the film industry, looking to avoid government intervention, wisely imposed self-censorship via the Hays Code. The Hays Code was a censorship standard embraced by the major studios to make films like these, quote, maintain social and community values. This method worked well because the studios were vertically integrated, that is, they had control of the films all the way to the screen. The conflict then wasn't between the government and the filmmakers, but between the filmmakers and the studios. Classic Hollywood. Besides the Hays Code, the Catholic Legion of Decency had influence over viewership, approving and disapproving films for viewing by Catholic audiences. Some films that were condemned include Queen Christina, Babyface, West of the Divide, Psycho, Eight and a Half, and A Clockwork Orange. The Legion of Decency was active into the 1970s. The Hays Code has also had lasting effects. It paved the way for the MPAA, which gives movies their familiar ratings, and carries a lot of weight deciding which movies get made and which do not. It's a cut on